What's up YouTube? This is Joel Too Cool. Today we're testing out Liquid X Detail Spray. Now a detail spray is something that you're going to want to put on, let's say you're going to a car show, something like that. You want your car to look its best, it's got a little bit of dust on it. Uh, this is the kind of thing that you would use. Uh, you can see here that I've got some dust and stuff on my truck. So we're going to go ahead and test it out. I'll also test it out on different things like the glass, the mirrors, uh, different places around the vehicle. Uh, see how it works. Now something like this is great for removing uh, fingerprints off of the vehicle. Uh, it also adds that little bit of extra protection. This one says it's got sealant like properties. Uh, it'll give you that just waxed look. So we're gonna test it out, see how it does. And let's get to it. So I sprayed a little of the quick detailer on a towel. I'm gonna do just one B pillar so we can see what it looks like with and without the quick detail spray. So it's a little cleaner. Uh, I'm not seeing a difference in shine. Now quick detailer spray will add a little bit of pr uh, protection from like UV rays and stuff. Uh, help prevent some of the dust and stuff from collecting there. All right, let's move on to the next spot. So another excellent choice for using a quick detailer is to spray it on a rag and do your door jams to help protect because water will get in here and when moisture gets in there, that's gonna build up uh, dirt and collect dust and stuff like that that you don't want. So you go in here with something like a quick detailer and it just adds that little bit of a hydroph hydrophobic playing field to kind of prevent some of that dust and stuff from sticking. That's simple. And you see this door jam here, it's got some dirt build up. It looks like mud got in there. Uh, anyway, quick detail or spray. We're not worried about scratches or swirl marks down here. It's not gonna do that much damage, if any at all. So I'll use that just as a purpose cleaner down here. Make sure you get the whole door jam. Cause when that dirt and water and mud and stuff collects down here, it's gonna eventually lead to rust, which you do not want. And just that little bit, see how dirty that was? Now I'll have to get a brush to get down into those holes and that's completely optional if you wanna do that. But like I said, that'll hold moisture and that will eventually lead to rusting. Another excellent choice for a detail spray is after you've cleaned your glass to apply it to that. Uh, it'll help keep the water running off of it, keep dirt and debris from sticking to it. Once again though, clean the glass first. And then just buff off the excess. You've got a clean, hydrophobic, dust-free window. And if you're gonna go through and clean your window, you might as well add it to your mirrors as well. It's quick, it's simple, and it's beneficial because it'll keep your glass, mirrors, windows, things like that all cleaner for longer. So I just did a small section of the hood here, and you can see just based off where the dirt is. So 
So it does pick up that light dirt dust debris that's on the surface. Uh, as for shine, I would say it's a little shinier, probably only because it's the clean spot on the hood. But once again, this adds a little bit of protection from UV. Uh, ideally, you'll want that over something that's already waxed because that's not gonna add that much protection. All right, so now we're gonna see how it compares against the Chemical Guys, uh, their brand, Quick Detailer. So let's just do a section over here. I gotta tell you, the Chemical Guys stuff, it smells very good, it's very berry-like. Uh, but in regards to the Liquid X stuff, theirs is very good smelling as well. It smells uh, kind of blueberry or blue raspberry candy-like. So they're both pleasant smell. We'll see how it compares down here on the actual paint. So now it's applied, I'll bring it in for a closer look. All right, so from up here, this streak over here would have been Liquid X. This streak over here would have been Chemical Guys. And in the middle, you can see there's still dirt and stuff there, so there's really no difference. So we'll look at them both. I mean, they both shine, they both smell good. It appears they both did what they were supposed to do. So yeah, quick detailers, not too bad. Uh, I have all the links down in the description. I hope you found this video useful, and thanks for watching.